wish I could be consistent with my glasses wearing, but apparently it just kind of amounts to if I forget I have them on my face or not. <laughs> so, yesterday, we have absolutely no food in our house because my parents get paid on the same day and it's really inconvenient for, like, midweek shops. So we have to, like, buy $400 worth of groceries, like, once a Sunday every month. It, it's bad. So I went out to get, like, Subway or something. And my sister was responsible for ordering for my mom and dad and herself because they were going to go shopping. Forgot that word for some reason. And I was supposed to order for myself, which would be good, except for the fact that I can't talk to people. So, like, literally, the girl was asking me, like, hey, what do you want? And I was like, aha, uh -huh, yeah, I'll have what I usually have. Except I was, I wanted American cheese, but they were out, so I had to go with cheddar. And I'm like, <laughs> anyway. So literally after I was done ordering, I was like <laughs> visibly shaking and I was actually doing this. So that was fun. And I was so scared for some reason. And that kind of tells you that I need to start talking to people more and actually go out. I didn't like that. I was about to cry right there in the subway. <laughs> and I felt so bad because we didn't have masks on and everyone else did. And I'm sitting here like, I actually might be sick. So that's Kale's documented experience about fiending anxiety in the line of a subway. Ow. This one was good though. Um, I got a foot long for some reason. I think it's just the fact that I get so nervous to eat sometimes that I just don't eat that my stomach kind of shrunk. So I only eat half of it. <laughs> yeah. Quarantine sucks. I hate this.